The Ukrainian general staff reported that Ukrainian forces continued offensive operations in the Melitopol direction in western Zaporizhia region and offensive assaults in the Bakhmut direction, inflicting losses on Russian manpower and equipment and depleting Russian forces along the entire front line. Ukrainian Eastern Group of Forces spokesperson Captain Ilya Yevlash stated that Ukrainian forces liberated additional two kilometers of territory in the Bakhmut direction. The Russian Ministry of Defense claimed that elements of the Russian southern grouping of forces repelled Ukrainian attacks near Mayorsk, about 20 kilometers south of Bakhmut. The UK Defense Ministry says over the last week Russian forces have made a concerted effort to conduct local counterattacks against advancing Ukrainian forces in both the Orykhiv and the Bakhmut sectors. In both areas, Ukrainian forces have defeated the Russian attacks and maintained their hold on recently liberated territory. Comments posted by the military community suggest extreme disillusionment among those involved in these counter-attacks, especially near Bakhmut, with reports of ill-conceived advances, lack of artillery support and heavy casualties. Over the last nine months, the Russian force in Ukraine has proved itself capable of conducting stalwart defensive operations. However, it continues to display only minimal capability of the offensive. Commanders struggle to orchestrate complex joint effects, to concentrate sufficient artillery, ammunition and to maintain high morale and offensive spirit.